Primary health care and Plunkett nurses have gone on strike and held protests across the country today, demanding pay parity with their health New Zealand colleagues. It's the first time in 35 years Plunkett nurses have gone on strike and follows more than a year of failed negotiations. Zane Small reports. In the capital, Christchurch and Auckland CBD, Nurses who work across aged residential care, general practice, hospices and urgent care joined forces with their Plunkett counterparts to demand pay parity. Yeah. Nurses at the hospital are currently paid 10% more than us. Can you tell me why? Plunkett nurse Chelsea Mitchell says they don't feel appreciated. We are a charity and people just, people just aren't seeing up the Plunkett nurses anymore because we're spread too thin. Earlier this month, primary health care nurses and Plunkett nurses both voted overwhelmingly to strike after rejecting a pay offer increase of around 3%. Further talks have stalled because their employers say their funding from the government is too low to offer more. If we were to um, match the pay parity with Te Whata Ora, that alone would cost us over $9 million just this year, and it's simply just not an affordable um, solution. Uh, we're already underfunded by our government. We do need to do something about it. I've been working on this for some time. I've been working with the New Zealand Nurses Organisation for some time. There's still a wee way to go um, to get a solution in front of both employers and the unions. I'm confident we will have something for them soon. He's promising a solution before the end of the year and no doubt hopes it'll make these not-so-subtle messages go away. Zane Small, News Hub.